On Syracuse's near west side, Wyoming Street is going to become a healthy main street. Martin Jacobs is the director of the Near West Side Initiative. We're asking uh, landscape architects and architects to design uh, uh, what we call a healthy main street and trying to create a streetscape that uh, encourages people to walk, run, and exercise along it and doing it in kind of creative, fun, artistic ways. Syracuse University's Marilyn Higgins is hosting the competition. She got the idea when she saw people of all ages interacting with these musical pavers and motion-activated lights newly installed here at Syracuse Stage. Nothing uh, combats crime more than people. Nothing combats a sense of isolation in a neighborhood or um, devastation in a neighborhood more than people on the street. Kids playing in the street, parents on the street. Um, when you have an active street life, an active public life, you've got a good neighborhood, a safe neighborhood. Some residents, like Mary Alice Smothers, who has lived on the west side for 39 years, are thrilled. To be able to have a street where we can have things saying, you know, have a big cucumber, the advantages of a cucumber, or have a tomato, and these are type of, you know, a salad you can make with recipes and vegetables, and, you know, to let people know that, you know, we got a, we got a bike lane, we can ride bikes up and down here. And so endless possibilities that can be done with it. The deadline for submissions is December 10th. A winner will be announced in April. Construction won't begin until the fall of 2014. For NCC News, I'm Tom Agnarelli.